Yeah. Let's go. We just gotta go hard. Hi everyone, how you doing? Trent and I again from Ones Ready, doing some mobility stuff that Trent just loves doing every single time we get together in the lab at 18 Alpha Fitness. Yeah, it's good to be back. You know, I gained like 40 pounds, 4th of July. So yeah, it wow. is what it is. That's that's great. I, I lost weight because I got the tooth pulled. <laughs> Not a fun experience, but uh, it was an emergency and needed to get it done the night before for the 4th of July. Jeez, yeah, not, not good. Uh, but hey, we want to discuss, uh, we got uh, down below on the YouTube, we'll have a link. If you're a prior special operations guy or support for special operations, uh, Operation Healing Forces has a link where you just fill out the form and then you guys can hop on one of my programs for free. Uh, I would greatly appreciate it if you do that. If you got any questions, just hit me up uh, at 18 alpha fitness at gmail.com about it. Uh, yeah, yeah. Are you saying they can just get better for free? For free. If you're so prior, no special, yeah. prior special operations uh, operator or if you're a support, it's not that hard. Oh, and for your spouses and kids, too. So you can sign everybody up. Jeez. All the nerds. All the nerds. All right. so, what, are we, what are we doing today, though? We're going to do wrist and elbows since my elbow. I've been playing tennis quite a bit. Elbows have been bothering me. Uh, my strings have been wrong. Uh, bracket's been wrong. Uh, so. Ask me how I know that you're a retired guy. Because I'm playing fucking tennis. <laughs> yes. yes. At least it's not golf. Uh, and, and Wimbledon's going on, too, right now. So uh, don't, yeah. don't know if Sinner's beating Medvedev right now. He was. And then Alcaraz is playing Tommy Paul, one of our two Americans left. Sports. Sports, yes. Something that Trent has no fucking idea about, right? <laughs> <laughs> I try. I used to be good at, like, watching sports, right, but right, just, yeah. I just lost track. Now, yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm gone. It's gone. It's good. That it's gone. It's good, because you don't have the TV on all day like I do, because Euros is going on today. Uh, soccer, that soccer <laughs> thing in Europe. <laughs> the rest of the world goes crazy about. Yeah. Yeah, the semifinals are today. <laughs> cool. Yeah, cool. <laughs> I'm just procrastinating actually having to do this because, you know, I think everybody at some point, if you do 20 years, uh, and it's something that like creeps up on you sometimes, and sometimes it happens all at once. Right. Uh, but I know my elbows, my wrists, I've had issues. And it's one of those things where you wake up one day and you get down to like do your push ups or you try to do yeah. something, and you're like, how come They're this moving better. does not work the way it used right, to? Right. Like, why does my elbow hurt randomly? Right. Why are my hands going numb? And uh, it's because I'm not. Doing what Kevin told me to do. Yeah, that's a lot of mobility work. Uh, and another thing, though, with 18 Outfit is we're going to have a, an add-on to my our programs is where you can just do the Ken stretch, uh, and it's going to be a monthly membership as well for the people that are not special operations. So nice. uh, it's going to be an add-on bonus to if you're already following one of my programs, you can pick this up, and it could be an add-on to whatever you're doing. Oh. And it's going to be a lot cheaper than uh, some other Ken stretch ones. Because I'm not as bendy as those guys, because I did a little bit more work than they did in their life. Yeah, well, I mean, some folks are out there worrying about themselves and how they look, and no offense to them, but like they're awesome. But like this is designed for y'all, yeah. for like normal folks trying to get, or or less than normal in right. my case, folks uh, trying to get better at mobility because you know health and family and all that other stuff for normal life reasons, or if you're trying to get into special operations. Better to start now than to embarrass yourself on camera 20 years later. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> All right, so we ready? Sure. All right, we're going to start off with the full body cars, all right? Yeah. So the neck, all right? Start off with the neck. Look down at your toes. Windshield wiper to the, your left. Drop that ear behind you. Look up at the sky. Okay, up. Go up and over, yeah. Oh, nice and tight. Look over at the right shoulder. Drop it. <laughs> it's Jeez. where they go. <laughs> Ow, and windshield wiper back over to the right side this time. Uh, reverse direction. Gosh, and go thanks. up. <sighs> Look over to your left shoulder, windshield wiper back to center, change direction, windshield wiper to the left. Look up and around. There you go. It's nice and easy. So Ooh, much listen. worse than working out. So much worse. Look at all that movement that he's got doing that. And he doesn't even have a fake disc like I do. Change direction. Not yet. Last one. I'm trying to avoid that but, stuff. Well, sometimes to alleviate pain and help. <sighs> and stop. Good. All right. We're going to do shoulder rotation. So squeeze the shoulders in the back, raise them up to the top, push your ears, roll them forward and down. There you go. Nice and slow up. 
is the key to fast roping is being able to do that squeeze in your back and down it's not all just grip no it's just creating that friction just a pro tip for all you out there and if you don't like your boots just grab with your feet a lot then you're going to rip right through them <laughs> and change direction come forward up that's one of those things when everybody started back there you go like uh, getting those like super lightweight boots, yeah, like the Nikes and all that. Oh, stuff. those things got demolished Ugh. quickly. <laughs> if you want to do an entire mission without boots, that's the way. Wear Nikes, and then you won't have any boots left. Yeah, and relax. Uh, all right, now shoulder cars. So that's where you adduct one arm across your body, right arm up as high as you can reach. Now externally rotate, reach back, reach back, continue to rotate, and the palm is going to be facing away. Good. Go back to that sticking point on rewind and across your body. Good. Oh, wow. I'm getting better at that. All righty. That's one thing I am getting consistent at, huh? Yeah. Well, I can do this at home pretty easy in front of the mirror. Just if I have like yeah. 30 extra seconds, because my shoulders traditionally have been, you know, like when I'm trying to do the stuff that right. I like to do, right, right. They get in my way a lot. Yeah. Well, you got to do something to keep them shoulders in the way because you want them to be actually to work yeah the last one this is something i actually care about <clears throat> not that i don't care yeah. about everything left else. side it's just we've talked about this yeah. i'm only good at implementing so many new things at a time right <laughs> uh, oh yeah that's it yeah step away from that rack uh, this is my good shoulder that is your good shoulder quote unquote yeah. and that's probably why it's like so tight it's because I probably rely on it way too much to do. You're lefty? No. Oh. It's just, just you're better, better out the two. It hurts okay. less when I do stuff with it. Oh, okay. And you know how it goes. Yeah. I'm glad of my shoulders. I never, well, besides get my pec torn out of my right side, it's shoulders are still pretty functional. Oh, there's a good pop. That's a good pop. And good. Right. Now the wrist. 90, so invert, up and around. That crunchy crunch. <laughs> and change direction. I have, I'm so uncoordinated when it comes to this. All right, now we're gonna do simultaneously the elbows. So palms facing forward and try to get the pinkies up to the sky and squeeze like you got 100 pounds of air going through. Up, 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 all the way up to the top. Externally rotate and push that air 100 pounds as much force as you can, but there's nothing gonna happen. And just contract as hard as you can. Good. Internal up, external down. And make sure you are breathing like Trent's doing. Internally up. And down. Um, reason I go to the gym before I come here, just so I like have a built-in excuse. I'm, like, I'm already <laughs> tired. That's my Palms story. facing you this time. You're gonna come in. Externally rotate. Pinkies up. Rotate, rotate as much as you can. Good. Palms facing you. Bring it up. Externally rotate. And down. Good. And then last one. Yeah. And down. Good. Oh. Now, give yourself a big hug. I'm going to do the back. I hate this. I hate this. <laughs> All right. So he's going to give himself a big hug, and he's going to just roll in his thoracic and try to look at his feet, just the thoracic, not the, not the lumbar, not the lower back. So just from here to here. Then he's going to twist to the right. Twist, twist, twist first before you. Oh, twist? Twist, twist. Now bend. <sighs> now extend up towards the ceiling. Twist to the left. Keep the hips there. Bend to the left. Roll around to the front. There we go. Twist to the right. Bend to the right. Look up at the ceiling. Twist to the left. Bend to the left. And look down at your feet. Good. One more time around. Twist to the left. Look up. Twist to the left. Bend to the left and come back to center. Now at the center, change direction. So twist to the left, bend to the left, come around, up, twist to the right. 
Good. Okay. And go around. Good. Keep on going. Two more times. Nice and easy. Like you said, like so much of this is like coordination where I, yes. I just want to like do what you tell me to do any way I can. <laughs> but like it's so awkward trying to do things the right way. Right. Believe me, when I'm doing this and the, the, the masters of this stuff are always there on, on me like this as well. There you go. And twist to the left. There we go. Good. Go ahead and stop. Favorite one. Now, put your left hand on that bar out as far as you can. Yep, there you go. So. We want to use our right leg, come across the body. Now out. And from here, rotate the, there you go. And bring it back around. Good. Now bring it back up. Knee as high as you can. Internally rotate. <sighs> Slow that down just a little bit. So bring it up. External out here. And from here, rotate. There you go. Rotate it out. Good. External. There we go. Rotate it internal. And one more. Internal. There we go. Extension. Anyway. Hey. And then with the old lefty? Yeah, you can go to the same side and go to lefty. I mean, I Just hold be on good, to it. Right? You should be good. There you go. Oh, wow. You got the depth a lot more. Oh, well, you know. <laughs> go back into extension. Yep. Rotate it. Bring it across. So yep. Now, there you rotate. go. Internal rotate. Yep. It's one. Two, three. Hey, when's Funky Bunkley coming? Uh, next week, I think. How oh, is it? We're going to have some fun with Mark. Uh, here we go. Uh, All right, now we're going to go on our butt. We're going to do our ankles and get those warmed up. Remember we're still to... warming up? Yes, this is still warming up. <laughs> Got to get the whole body cars. Controlled articulation, so rotation. So I mean, I love this so much. So, left leg. So this time we're going to just work on our tip fib and our knee. So externally rotate that foot as much as you can. Kick it up as high as you can. Internally rotate it and bring it down. Externally rotate it. Kick it up. Internally rotate it. Squeeze it down. External. Up. Internal. Down. Now let's keep it down. Internally rotate it. Kick it up. Externally rotate it. Bring it back down. Internally rotate it. Kick it up. Externally rotate it. Back down. And last one. Good. Switch sides. For the knee. Externally, let's start an external rotation. Kick it up. Internally rotate it. Back down. Externally rotate it. Up, internally rotate it, back down, externally rotate it, bring it up, internally rotate it, bring it down, and last one, up, and down. Keep it internally rotated, yep. kick it up, externally rotate it, back down, internally rotate it, kick it up, externally rotate it, down, internal, uh, up, out, and down. Good. Now, get to do the old ankles so you're gonna be on your heel with your left foot and all you're gonna do is externally rotate it gas pedal down windshield wiper across bring it up externally rotate it gas pedal down internally rotate it bring it up externally rotate gas pedal across and up this time internal rotation gas pedal across external bring it up gas pedal down <sighs> Internal and last one on this foot. I'm trying to slow down on my gas pedal down. <laughs> like I just want to like shoot it across, you know. All right, this time externally rotate it, gas pedal down, internally rotate it, bring it up, externally rotate it, gas pedal down, internally rotate it, up, external, gas pedal, internal, up. Now internal, gas pedal down, external rotate it. Bring it up, external, external, up, and last one. 
Good. All righty. So I think we're going to stay here. Okay. Because uh, we're going to start doing, we're going to do some expansion breaths. I'm going to grab a yoga block so you are not mm. uncomfortable. Glad my socks are matching today. That's, that's a first. <laughs> All right. So what we're going to do here is we're going to do some expansion breath okay. at the beginning so we can get our ribs and stuff. Yeah, I think I'm going to go on my knees. Go on if, knees? You, if you want to, if this, this, if this bothers you, no, that don't bother you. Okay. I mean, my knees have been my knees for a long time, so. Yeah, see, that even bothered me, so. Might as well give it a go. Okay. You can just feet toes up, up or feet down. It doesn't matter. Okay. What I want you to do, I'm going to go back down myself. All right. So, one hand on your chest, one hand on your belly, and I want you to take a deep breath in through your belly. And let it out. You feeling that belly breath? And let it out. All right, one more in and let it out. All right, now I want you to breathe in through your chest, All right, up at the chest, and let it out. In through the chest, and let it out. One more and let it out. All right, now let's put our hands down now that we got understanding of what belly breath is and what chest breath is one of the, the you know when you have like a lot of time to think about how you did what you did right i think one of the few advantages i had besides like soccer and cardio and all that is i knew how to breathe yeah, like i was a, i was a singer in choir and all that other nerd stuff growing up but like that's where you learn like how to breathe from your belly and it's like they talk about how your lungs go all the way up and uh you know, when things get hard, what do you do? You take big, deep breaths, and if you're getting more oxygen than the guy next to you, even though he's stronger, you can keep going and going and going. Huge, so. huge difference if you know how to breathe properly. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it's absolutely huge. And I didn't find this stuff out until, what, 2015, 16, when I went to Vancouver and did my first Wim Hof yeah. thing. Wow. Game changer, man. Uh, game changer stuff with the breath. Uh, and wish. I, I, you know, thinking about it on my career is I, I used to tell myself, breathe in through my nose mm -hmm. and out through my mouth while running and while rucking all the time. Yep. Whenever I was running or rucking, I would tell myself that. So, you know, it, it wasn't something that I, I got taught on how to do properly when in music, but it was something that I did cognitively when I was training uh, in, in the military. Well, that's how you know if you're going too far. Like if you're working on your aerobic system, right? Like right. if you can't breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth, like you're probably going a little too far. Too hard. Yeah. Like if you're trying to go full out, right? right. It's right. A different yeah, thing, yeah. you're not going to breathe in through your nose, mouth, in through your nose, out through your yeah. mouth if you're going 100 ham for a while. And that, that, having that grind pace right. is everything. Yes. If, if you can go hard for five minutes, awesome. But like these selection courses, you got to grind. It's a grind, man. It's not a sprint. All right, sorry. All right. So what we're going to do now is we're going to do expansion breath on the belly. So we're going to breathe in, let a little out, and breathe back in. Let a little out. Now let it all out. Suck that belly all the way in. Let it all out. Now, as tight as it is, Oh, got a cramp, 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 cramp oh, in the shoulder. <laughs> I'm breathing. Crampy cramp on the shoulder, breathing. <laughs> Ow, fudge. Whatever popped earlier hurts. Okay, I'm okay. Okay. So let's get all the air out of our belly. All right. And then just a little breath in and then out. And suck it in deeper. 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 Trent's getting old, y'all. Yeah. It has to happen on camera. On camera, right? <sighs> oh, my dear. What the fuck is that? <laughs> so, so I'm going to raise this up because I'm going to sit up a little bit because that's a little uncomfortable on the backside for a little while. 
Yes, that's so much gooder. So what we're going to do is we're going to palm up, right? You're going to wrap your thumb first on the outside. Bring this around. One wrap all the way around. All right. And so what we're going to do is we're going to try to we're going to in, do internal rotations just at the elbow. Okay. So get so my elbow tucked in. Get tucked in tight, right? Pull this slack as much as you can. To put some tension on this. And we're going to do eight internal rotations. That's one. That's two. Three. Four. And this is really good for tennis elbow or golfer's elbow. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. All right, we're going to undo that. And then this time, palm is facing down, and you're going to go over the top and bring it back in. Bring that tension, and you're going to go out. And that's not right. That's the same way. I think we come across. Oh, yeah, that's it. You'll run it under first? No, you come across. Your palm is facing up. You're going to come on the inside, yep, and then bring it. Then. Yes, yeah, then, then we're getting way more tension coming out. Yeah, one, you feel that tension? Yeah. Two, three, and I really feel it. This is really good for the medial aspect of your elbow. Uh, this is where I feel it in my tennis elbow. Six, seven, and eight. Woo! <sighs> <laughs> Everything hurts. <laughs> well, you know what? Let's just go ahead and sit on our butt talks. Okay. Because that's hurting my toes. <sighs> Cross leg if up. you want. Yeah, if you want to. That's totally if you. Yeah, so much easier oh. this way. Not as much stress. All right. <sighs> okay. So elbow in, loop on the outside, running it around once for the internal rotation. Got that tension. Got it? Got it. So eight. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. All right. Now undo it and bring it across the front of your palm. Wrap it. And then we're going to do palm is facing down. Yep. Externally rotate to the outside. It's one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, woo, and eight. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. <laughs> Little band yeah. work. Woo. No, so say you don't have a band, all right? Let's go ahead and put the band down. Now, all you're going to do is you're going to grab it, grab it, grab your wrist, right? And try to pull it down. And then you're just going to let it come in and do an internal rotation. Just do a couple of those. It's, you're not going to be able to hold your, you know what I mean, to keep yeah. it that way. And then do the same thing, go on the top for external. Just provide that tension? Yep, just provide that tension. And what you do on one side, do on the other. And three. All right. Now the fun stuff. Step out the way. Oh, if I can get up. Yeah. Woo. Woo -woo. I'm going to need to buy a, a lighter one. Matter of fact, I'm going to put this thing's like 20 pounds. That's ridiculous. <laughs> Ow. Mm. 
right. So, oh, okay. yeah, yes, some good stuff. <clears throat> I'll put on the green, green ones. We're just basically doing the same thing with weights. Okay. So. And if you don't have little ankle weights or something like that, you can grab, like, I got a five-pound dumbbell up there. Or my, oh, I could use my three-pound dumbbell, my wife's. Or her five. Yeah. So, same thing. But with the weight, yeah, internal rotation, doing eight of those. Yep, did the, yep, I did the Sorry. elbows tucked in tight. <gasps> Tuck your elbows. <laughs> <Tuck your elbow. laughs> yeah, that's not as much fun. No, it's not, in it? You're like, oh, it's only five pound weight. It's good though, because like, <laughs> and then do the external. This weekend on Sunday, I did go a little hard, and then life got in the way, and I didn't make it to the gym on Monday. Oh, okay. So today, when I went to the gym, you felt it? Well, had to, and I know you can't really make up for a lost workout day, but mm -hmm. you know, you just try to crush yourself. Right. And that's what you did today? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then got home, back to the house a little bit late, and then just packed up my crap and came over here. <laughs> for workout number two for today for Trent. It's, it's good. Yeah. It's always good to get at least two fur in for once. Yeah. My kids are like, why do you have to go? I'm like, I don't want to. <laughs> you don't have to do anything. You're retired now, Trent. All right, into ten. Four. Eight and then eight out. One, two, and eight. All righty. All right. I think we should be done with that for now. I've seen that would help with like uh, some of the stuff with like a you know punch in the bag or fighting. Oh my god, this is like great being for able to fighters. Turn over your fist correctly. You know, because they always tell you, like, I like to throw my hooks and leave my hands up and down. They're like, that's not the way to do it. You know, like, the Muay Thai guy that you can barely understand because his English is terrible. <laughs> Turn the fist over. Turn the fist over. Turn it over. All right. Just kidding. I'm sorry. If, if he ever watches this, love you. Yeah, love, love Muay Thai guys. Mu, Mu Thai guys. I would love to get to Thailand. Anybody that wants me to come out to Thailand to do a Ken Stretch class. <laughs> <laughs> Huge sacrifice. <laughs> Huge sacrifice. I don't know. I pass a Thai chama cup. That means I speak Thai. Just a bit, no, a little bit. A little bit. Just a little bit. The two two in Thai or what? Oh, one plus one plus. I used uh, to be back in the day. Not. I'm probably like a zero minus zero minus now. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna do some wrist. Yay. No, it's not yay. It sucks. <laughs> All right. You remember the wrist? Oh, jeez. All right. So we're gonna warm up our wrists first because wrists are very tender and sensitive a lot. So palms are facing towards us and all we're gonna do is just rock back a little bit and get that little stretch right in here. Just a little bit. We're gonna do 10 of those. <laughs> this is kind of good because like you can make this as miserable as you want and it's kind of yes. fun just to feel the ridiculous way this feels if you don't do it a lot, I guess. And gymnasts are notorious for having great wrists. Because they do this all the time. Oh. Oh. I remember watching Starch do this with students at the prep course. And I was like, mm, no, nah. thank you. Okay. Mm, yeah. Oh. Then we're going to internally. Yeah, yes. sure we are. Try to get as much as you can and just do it like a little. Oh, my. Yes. Yeah. What is my right does not do what the left is supposed to do? Yeah. Just roll it around the whole body. Make it as bad as you want it. Good. Now, 
I'm just going to turn. So if you can't get your hand like this and your hand is like that doing push-ups, when you're doing push-ups and you got, and it gets to that, there's going to be some pain in that little movement after doing hundreds and hundreds of push-ups. So the ideal is for you to at least get 90. This is a little bit better than 90, but you want 90, all right? Yeah. Especially when you're coming in through the prep course. There's a time and a place to use like the bars or to like right. do on your fists if you're, you know, a cool person or whatever. But if you're doing that because it hurts your wrist to do, right. do push-ups, you need to do something about it. You need to be doing this stuff. All right, now here comes the fun stuff. Jeez, God. All right, we're gonna do some pals and rails with our hands and wrists and fingers and things. So, <laughs> <laughs> so what we're gonna do is we're gonna be right here. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a deep breath in. All right, pack that air down, radiate. Radiate means putting tension into the whole system. All right. And then we're gonna drive our fingers down into the ground, uh, starting off at 20%, ramping it up to probably like 40, okay? Sure, 40%, yeah. And then when I tell you to, we're going to do a regressive angular isometric load, and that's going to be, you're going to try to lift your hand, fingers off, which is very not going to happen, really. How far back should you? All right, okay. just hover wherever you're comfortable okay. with, all right? And we're going to hold that for about 10, 10 seconds or so. Uh, and then we'll come out and we'll do some more rotations on our wrist to get all that out. Uh, but this feels really good. Okay, if anybody in the comments can explain to me what 40% feels like, please let me know. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Just do your best. All right. All right. So you ready? Sure. All right. Take a deep breath in. Pack that air down and start driving your fingers into the ground at 10%. <laughs> not at 100. 20%. 30%. And 40%. And for Trent, just go ham. Go as hard as you possibly can. Don't tell him to drive him to the ground. If you as hard as you can. Drive. Hold it. Keep driving. Drive. Drive. And you hold this about 20 to 30 seconds. So it's something that doesn't feel good on isometric load. My fingertips are turning white. Trent's are turning white, which is a good thing. For five, four, Three, and remember when I get to one, we're gonna to try to lift our fingers off without pulling our arms out anywhere else. Two, one, stay where you're at, lift them up, lift them up, lift them up, lift them up, hold it, hold it, hold, hold, lift them up, lift them up, lift them up, lift them up, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, and relax. Yeah, 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 yeah. All righty. 40% fucking sucks. <laughs> yes, 40% sucks. All right, so we're gonna come up. Palms facing up. We're going to do some rotations in those wrists. So the same thing, internally rotate up, out, and around. Nice and slow. Change directions. <laughs> I'm one of those like seer videos where I should be blinking SOS right now. Yeah. I feel like under duress. All right. Good. That's round one. We're doing two more. Get these... Wrist going good. Start for the cussing. I'll stop. Be professional. Be professional. Be, be professional. professional. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Take a deep breath in. Pack that air down. Start driving at 10%. 30%. Sure. 40%. And then Trent's all out max effort. Uh, drive it. Come on. Drive. Uh, drive. Drive. Come on. Hold it. You're doing great. Hold it. Breathe. Breathe. Five. Four. Remember the same thing. When I get to one, you're going to regress. Two. One. Now let them off. Let them off. Hold it. Hold. 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 Hold it up. And relax. All right. This time, you want to. I'm <laughs> chasing around and rock back nice and easy. Okay. And then, this is like that theory where, like, if I shoot you in the leg, you won't care about yeah. how much <laughs> something else hurts anymore. Have you ever done these before? No. All right. So you're going to try to palms are facing up. And you're just gonna come here and then just come up into like a, making a fist. Yes. And come down and into the fist. 
come down and then to a fist. And now the, how to make this harder is move your knees back. I'm not sure I'm there. Yeah, me neither. That's about as far as I can go because this shit hurts. <laughs> and then come up into a fist, and then we're just going to rock back and forth this way forward. That's a lot more easier. <laughs> My hands forgot to have to make fists for a minute. My thumbs were all over the place. Uh, all righty. I'm out. Oh, yeah, feeling a little bit better. Ready for this last one? Yeah. <laughs> all righty. Take a deep breath in. Pack that air down. Start driving into the ground at 10%, 20%. 30% and Trent effort. Drive it. Drive. Keep going. You're doing great. Hold it. Make sure you're breathing. Keep hold it. Hold. Hold. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Lift your fingers off. Hold it. Lift them up. Hold it. Hold. Hold, hold, and relax. Yes. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> yeah. Whew. And just to test, I just want to, there's a difference between that, what that is right now, and what it was. Oh, not bad. I'm, getting, I'm starting to. I always want to bend my elbow. You always do want to bend your elbow. Yeah. I don't know. Compensate. Compensate for everything. All right. Okay. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna do some maximal breath work. But wait, there's more. Yes, yes. That was just the elbows, and I didn't tell you about the, the breath work. So what you're gonna do? I'm gonna. Exp you're gonna lay on your back and I'm gonna breathe to take you through this. Okay. Uh, and you can use that as a pillow type thing. Okay. <sighs> that's uh, that's fine. I got it. Got it? Yeah. All right. I promise not to fall asleep. Don't fall. You're, oh, you're not gonna fall asleep on this shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You ready? Yeah. Belly, chest, head. Let it go. Belly, chest, head, 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 let it go. Keep it up. At that rhythm, nice and easy. 30 seconds in, got a minute and a half more to this breath. Keep it going. It's fine, a nice, good rhythm. We're doing two minutes of this. Get that much air as you can into those lungs, starting from the belly, going up to the chest. Try to fill up in the head with some air, which you can't. Just do your best. We're a minute in. We've got a minute left. Good. Got 30 seconds. You're doing great, Trent. Good. All right, last one in. And on the exhale, you're going to hold. Let it go and hold. 
All right. On this hold, it's up to you. You want to get about a minimum of at least 30 seconds. Max is whatever you can do. But the max that I don't want him to do is to start going down that dark tunnel where you start almost about to pass out. That's not a good thing, okay? We're not going to that level yet. This breath work for this is not to go down that dark tunnel. It's not for your pre-dive stuff. This is just to increase your aerobic capacity, all right? And you most definitely don't want to do this one before you go into the water. This is not performance free dive. This isn't institute stuff that gets you ready for pre-dive. This is just to get your system set up to increase your aerobic capacity, all right? And when you need to take a breath, I want you to take a one massive inhale through your nose. Take it in, now squeeze every muscle on your body. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Five, four, three, two, one, let it go. Belly, chest, head, 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 let it go. I'm doing great. Belly, chest, head, Belly, chest, head. So you want to get in this nice rhythm here. Uh, yoga music is really good with this one when you're trying to relax a little bit. Uh, listening to my voice probably is not calming to nobody. Uh, probably need some those uh, yoga bowls. We're doing some sound stuff. Does some amazing stuff for the vibration. Uh, right, we're one minute into this one. I'm doing great. Just focus on your breath. And if you can, there's a third eye in between your eye, eyes. Try to focus on that. And you want to do each one of these, the belly chest heads for 30 minutes. Usually if you're doing a correct breath work, it's probably anywhere from 30 to 35 of those belly chest head breaths. And you got about 30 more seconds for the next one. Good. Belly, chest, head. There we go. Got two more breaths in there. Last one. And then the exhale, hold for as long as you'd like. Just relax. And again, this isn't a max effort thing. We don't need to go to that because if a max effort is when you start going to the, to the Lulu down the black tunnel where you start to pass out. It's not what we want to do here. All right. So again, he's just on that exhale. Trent's holding it for as long as he can. Once he need, feels that need, just that, that first initial need for oxygen, I want him to take a deep breath in and then squeeze every muscle in his body. That's a minute. Squeeze everything. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Five, four, three, two, one. There it is. <sighs> All righty. And just chillax for a second. Oh, that is some oxygen drunk. Isn't it? You get there. That's wild. I've never had you do this before? No. Really? Oh. Yeah. Holy crap. All right. When you feel like it, roll over <laughs> to your side. All right. Roll over to your side and then sit up. All right. when you, when, after you're doing some breath work and you're laying down, don't immediately, don't do a, 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 a sit, up. sit up. You might uh, go night night. Uh, roll over to your side and then get up. Yeah, that's, that felt great. That's when you said good. that was a minute, I was like, there's no way that was a minute. Oh, yeah, yeah. Just, just each breath hold that you had was a minute. Jeez. So, uh, 
you know, just do, do max effort for yourself. All right. Cause everybody's different. All right. It doesn't matter how long that breath hold is just do it to where you feel that first initial response. If you need a breath, that's when you take your, yeah. your breath. Like I wasn't pushing like, that, That's the crazy thing about right. it. It's like, it was a minute that was super easy. Right. Like right. on an exhale. Mm -hmm. and like, like you said, as soon as like you feel the first, like, Hey, I need something, you know, like you didn't fight it. I didn't fight right. it. It's just right. like, okay. Yeah. Like just go ahead and take but it. Was, it was wild. How like you feel. Yeah, I went, I went somewhere else for a little bit, I think. Yeah, yeah. It, you usually do. Uh, uh, the first time I did this in Vancouver, man, we did it for 45 minutes straight. Jeez. But then besides that, we did a little bit more to where you're really going ham on. I mean, we went ham. Sure. And I mean, it really gets your system up uh, and probably the best feeling I ever had. Just twice that felt right. amazing. Right. Usually, you know, and then you want to do that like three to five rounds of that. Normally, I just want to cut that off because uh, you guys might get bored with it. Uh, you might, you know, belly chest. Hey, it doesn't sound fun for minutes on end. Right. And then yeah. watching Trent breathe here is not ex exciting for you guys. He's laying there blinking. And he's okay. laying here blinking and he's alive. All right. Uh, but you can do this on your own. It's a great, great thing to start start your day off. Uh, in my programming, I do have people doing a breath, that same breath work. Uh, for three to five rounds and then into that daily cars routine, the right. mobility stuff. That's when you wake up, it's great for your whole body. Just get your body ready for the day's work. Sweet. <clears throat> so that was amazing. Good. All How right. You like it. Good. That's it, man. That was nice to end on a high note. Yeah. Pun intended. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> well, head on over to 18A Fitness uh, if you want to pick up a program. And then it's always onesready.com uh, for doing this stuff. And also at onesready.com, you can get one of these sweet. 18 Alpha shirts, uh, so you can wrap the gear and the merch. And uh, we'll see you all next time when I come over here to get tortured and also for some super weird experiences with uh, oxygen. Yeah, we're going to do it. We're going to go do another one level since now that I know that Trent likes this. <laughs> all right. Mm -hmm. All right. We'll see you all later. Peace. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. We just got to go hard.